had this hair for a really, really, really long time. I've had long hair for most of my life. So it's time for a change. Change is good. Don't be afraid. Try new things. I'm kind of nervous. Now that I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh my God, maybe I shouldn't cut it. Yes, I should. Yes, I'm going to. It's going to be fine. Hello, beautiful human beings. Tomorrow is my haircut. Tomorrow I'm scheduled for a haircut at noon. If you are new to my channel, welcome. This is a series following my hate, my <laughs> This is a series following my curly hair, wavy hair journey. This video being my actual haircut video that I've been mentioning in a few of my earlier videos. Um, and if you're a returning subscriber, it's happening people, we're doing it. Super excited. I'm still really nervous. When I, my hair is all straightened and nice like this, I'm like, oh, it doesn't look bad at all. I should just leave it. I just want to cut it to change things up and, you know, try something new and challenge myself a little not to be so, not to use my hair as a security blanket, which I know that I do. I definitely um, use it to hide behind. I wear it down a lot, like down in my face. A lot of people have told me not to get it cut too short so that I can't put it in a ponytail because I do work out a lot. But to that I say, no. I'm not gonna let anything external about my life influence what I decide to do in the salon tomorrow. I just wanna go and do whatever I wanna do and not think about, oh, what about working out? What about this? What about that? What if I can't do this? I'm just gonna go for what I feel like doing and everything else will just have to fall into place later. I'll just figure that out. Just wanted to film this now to show you what my hair looks like when it's all straightened, how long it is right now. Now that I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh my God, maybe I shouldn't cut it. Yes, I should. Yes, I'm going to, it's gonna be fine. I've had this hair for a really, really, really long time. I've had long hair for most of my life. So it's time for a change. Change is good. Don't be afraid. Try new things. Okay. It's actually was really hard that my, when my appointment was postponed because I was so amped for it and now, now I've had my hair for another week and I've been straightening it and putting curl in it and enjoying it. And it almost, but I'm just, I just don't want to back out. I don't back out of things. As you know, when I commit to something, I do it. Also, Skylar will be coming with me to the hair salon. Um, I hope. They do have a lot of work to do tomorrow since the appointment was changed, so I'm not quite sure if they'll be there for the whole appointment. I'm kind of nervous. Okay. So we will, um, I will check in with you tomorrow, most likely right before we're headed to the hair salon. Good morning, beautiful human beings. I'm so excited because today is finally the day I'm getting my haircut. Going to have a shower soon, gonna have some coffee, gonna wake up, really excited. Um, I'm gonna follow the steps that I mentioned in my last video about how to prepare for a big drastic cut. I'm doing it all over again. So I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. again and this time we're actually headed to my hair appointment which is still happening and unfortunately due to unforeseen circumstances Skylar can't come with me so I'm going to do this alone which is fine I can do it <laughs> totally fine I can definitely do this alone I'm really excited and so I'm gonna do my best to film what I can and um, yeah we'll just go from there you can FaceTime me yeah, I'll FaceTime you. <laughs> Costs a million dollars. Data. You don't have it. nervous because I'm the reality is it's just hair but it is also a big change for me so I'm excited for that because I've had this look for a very long time <laughs>
Oh my god. Oh, it feels so nice. Oh, I'm free. excuse if you can hear Skylar, they're on a business call out there. That is why I'm back in my bathroom. I have to say, honestly, you guys, I freaking love it. I um, do not regret it at all. I actually, it wasn't until Ryan actually cut the hair off that I realized how much I wanted to get rid of it. I feel so much better, so much more like myself. I'm super excited for all the different hairstyles that I'm gonna be able to do now with my short hair. And I'll definitely make some videos of that in the future. Um, this is how he styled it, and um, I'm gonna see you know, the different ways that I'm gonna try to style it, straightening it, maybe putting more curl in it, but overall, I'm in love. So, if you're thinking about cutting your hair, check out the videos I've posted about preparing for that. Go for it, do it, I love it. Comment below if you like it. Comment below if you think I should have left it. Um, hit the subscribe button to see all my future videos. Hit the little bell so you get notified when those videos come out. And thank you so much for following me on the journey so far, all the way from that to this. Ah, thank you so much, love you guys. See you in the next video, thank you Ryan. You're the best. Ryan, I feel trip. Hair salon in Vancouver. Always a good time. Can't stop playing with it. No! Ah!